election. And if things don't get better quickly for this flailing Prime Minister who has no political judgment, then many suspect he'll call an early election. And one thing I know for sure is that there are no guarantees for anyone in this place. So this may be the last opportunity I have to speak directly to Australians about what is most important to our future. You have the power to exercise your democratic right and vote for a change at the next election. Yeah. But before you do, I want to ask you a few simple yes-no questions. Have those promises made to you by the Prime Minister come to fruition? Are you better off now than you were three years ago? Are your power bills lower? Are your mortgage payments lower? Is your life actually easier now than in 2022? And if the answer is no to these questions, and I suspect so, then it's time for a rethink. It's time to readjust the course of our nation. You can choose a different way, a future where fairness, opportunity, enterprise and prosperity are within reach for all Australians. A country with strong leadership, where infl inflation and interest rates are lower, where more houses are being built for Australians, where people of the Jewish faith do not fear for their lives in their own suburbs, in their own homes, and where entrepreneurialism is thriving. Not 24,729 insolvencies in two and a half years under this.